Hello, this is Colin, and welcome back to another video. Today, I'll be doing my Thomas and Friends haul. I'm excited for this. This has been anticipated for a lot of time, so let's get into it. I ordered lots of things. It's finally all here. We have the, the Bertram. First, I'll be opening Bertram. I'll try to get as much of this on camera. Oh yeah, this is the only thing that's e that came in the packaging. The rest, I'll just be reviewing. Got him out. So, as you see on the bottom, Bertram, Bertram's tender. Um, what I like about him is you can basically convert him into a tank engine and a tender engine. Most people don't know this about the new model, but he kind of has a bunker, which is weird. And he has a tender. So, look, now he looks like a tender engine. Now he looks like a tank engine. Tender, tank. Tender, tank. So, the original model of him in the TV show was tender, but um, then, to make it, um, but then, Britt Allcroft said she made a mistake, so she made him a tank engine like this, but then, they brought, the new Tom Skies Mattel brought it back like this, but you could also convert it into a tank engine, but if they, one thing, if they wanted to make it more accurate, why, wait, look. I'll be right back. Here's my Duke model. They made two versions of Duke. This version of Duke has these side, like, things. And they wanted to make the original Duke a little more accurate, so they put those on. But this Duke doesn't have, I mean, this Bertram... In the TV series, he used Duke's model, so shouldn't he have those things like right here? This this was Duke, this was Bertram. They're supposed to kind of look the same, so they kind of do look the same, but they were just painted different. And I can see how they look almost identical, but... Um, I could see the bunker, which makes them look not identical, but th that's okay because the feature they wanted to go for, but something that really upsets me is there. Next up, we have the Sodor Railway Repair, which it came outside the packaging. Here he is. Now, the back car seems to be used a lot because I got it outside the packaging. I didn't get the back weird other non-canon car because I feel that's unnecessary and I feel that's not canon and I feel that that should have never existed in the first place. It's not very dude. Turtle and Thomas. So, yeah, I bought it for... We bought it... I bought it, basically, for the... For this, uh, this main Soda Railway Repair part. Also, I thought this would, this would go nice on the back sometimes, but mostly I like this. This is really cool, though. So, yeah. Moving on to Stepney. So, Stepney. Oh, wait. First, uh, Bertram. Bertram says on the wheels, dated 2012. Total Railway Repair says on the wheels, dated 1998. Now, Stepney. He, he has the, this looks like the wooden funnel, but it's actually plastic. Plastic dome, wooden body. Doesn't have the name on the bottom because it's dated on the wheel, 19... 99 and I believe they started putting the names on in 2000. That's what I believe at least. I'm not really sure. So anyway, uh, this is Stepney. I think he's really cool. Let's move on. So we have a lot of them for the next one. I'll be going worst to best, I guess. So, yeah. We have a standard red cargo car right here that came in a lot. 
I have many of these, so I guess it's okay. Next, we have an empty sugar car. Oh, wait, uh, the standard cargo car was dated. 2003. Sugar car dated... 2003. These are all basically dated 2003. So, the sugar car. Yeah, not too good. A little bit more detail than the other one. We have the butter car that came next in the lot. It's okay. Butter can be taken out. Magnet on top of the butter. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Now, next one is this coal car. Um, this coal, soda or coal company. Um, this is magnetic, if you don't believe me. It sticks onto here, which is magnetic. I promise I don't have any sticky stuff on there. So, yeah. And it came with the car, so there's that. Next, we have two that tie, the zoo car and the box car. Actually, no, no, before that, before that, we have the, the baggage car. Yeah, I really like it. I actually really, really like this item. It's really cool, to be honest. This is the stuff that I actually think is phenomenal. I love it. Next time, we have the zoo car and the box car. Both dated, you guessed it, 2003. This is dated 2003. Basically, everything I'm picking up dated 2003. Yeah, 2003. Everything is 2003. Except Bertram. Sort of real over here. Exactly. Everything in this lot is 2003. Now... These are both dated, yep, you guessed it, 2003. Uh, um, they're basically tied. I like the detail on them. I like this moving, the moving piece. I like that they have something on the inside of the moving piece. I know they do that to attract kids' attention, but I really think it's cool. So, also, we have this. If you open this like that, there's a monkey, which I think is really cool. And, yeah. Next, we have the jewel car. I think it's really cool. You can look at the jewels inside. So many jewels. Ooh, lovely jewels. I can definitely buy this. Yeah, that's what a million kids must have said. It's really cool to me. Um, I really, really like this item. Not much more to say about it. There's one more thing that could top it, though. Can you get... Have you guessed it? Gold car. The gold car. Dated. Can't read that. I can't read this one, but I'm guessing it's dated 2003. It's either that or 1990-something. Thing, but 2003 or 1990 something that's what I know so yeah I really really love this this is amazing but after this lot there's another thing we bought and that is oh my god that last thing so yeah gold car we're done with that one lot. And as you see, I saved the best for last. One I've wanted literally all my life. You may have caught a glimpse of it there. Toad. I am so proud to have Toad. 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 I can't believe I have Toad. Toad is amazing. 
he has the brake here. Most people don't know. If you put the brake, the wheel can't spin anymore. Wait, push that back completely. Wait, what? What? It malfunctioned. So now, see? It doesn't, doesn't spin. It's really cool. His purpose is to be at the back of trains. So let's say Stepney was running down the hill and the baggage car and the box car were full. Someone was moving. A family was moving and they were full of baggage. Oh no, they're going to crash. Toad puts the brake down, saves them all. Yeezys. You know, I don't really want to drop him, but. Now, as you notice, I've dropped literally every single train into one pile. And I'll show you everything I got off eBay in a big pile, including the box for Bertram. This is the pile of everything I got off eBay. Should equal 12 items from five sellers. If I could say my favorite, it would be Toad. Uh, second favorite, Soda Railway Repair. Third favorite, Bertram. Fourth, Stepney. Last, all these amazing cars. These cars are amazing. And like I said, the gold car is my favorite out of these lot. This lot. Hopefully I can do another Thomas lot at like the end of this month. Uh, um, another Thomas haul at the end of this month. So, hope you guys enjoyed this. Type comments down below if you want me to do another one of these. Or, like, a Lego haul. Or, like, any video you want to recommend. Like I said in my 20 sub, six, sub special. I will give shout-outs. Next time anyone leaves a comment down below, I'll, I'll do... I'll answer it. I'll maybe do a video if you guys... Uh, comment a video down below no matter how crazy it is even though there are a few boundaries so yeah guys hope you enjoyed this video 